Black to Canarium. Hmm? Do you take this out? Let's go destroy traits, electric sound transmitters. And this is a canarium. Secondary component, primary component, part, secondary part, primary part, interior and mounted on the glove, so... Okay, so the canarium is on the glove, it's not the glove itself. Okay. Can we leave? Not so easy. So the only room left is the basement. Okay. Lying outside the known space time continuum, this is a dimension to which the gate is knowledge and the key is the conarium. As we start to shed our fleshy bindings, we start to perceive more and more. If we inquire by merely knowing and thinking on any subject matter, windows to related time and space open up before our non-material selves, our minds. And what's better, we've grasped that the experiences in the sessions are shared and even improved by all of the attendees' personal knowledge. If thinking about the possibilities that may bestow upon us in our quest for transcending the limits of our mortal bodies is about to make me crazy. But sometimes I wonder what has been keeping our sanity intact inside of this forbidden place. Behind the thick walls of pitch darkness surrounding us, there is something looming, whispering in my ears in a language familiar, yet I cannot discern its content. It's free, okay. We need three symbols to input into the device. Those three symbols I believe we can take from this one. Again, this one is locked. Can we? Nope. I apply when the Looks like something's missing here. What exactly? I cannot really tell. Okay, we have only a flashlight on us. Oh boy. I mean, it will be a hunt for a thing. Could be anywhere. I love those paintings with paralysis demons. Six thirteen. Ah, uh, it gives me an idea. Why the okay, zero one one two three four five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Nope. Can I be 
something upstairs? I saw him having visited. Is a head. Thirteen is a head. We still have the crow. Wait, where's the crowbar? Thirteen is a head. Heads must be marshaled, such a great mind can be pronounced by getting dried under the scorching sun. Was okay, uh, yeah, we don't have to go back and check those again. I think we can make it out. Is there a sun? Sun. Uh, uh, sun. Uh, one, six, thirteen. One, I really can't find the cast characters. Two versions, but this one is extremely rare. It's called Urhan, but knows how it means, but it's a the version Dark Sphere Inside a Light one. Dark Inside Light. This one I think is the best depiction. And the six. Mask of an old power from Moon Goddess. Huh. We are definitely going back. Oh, we don't need to. In archaic myths, lurking in shunned and forbidden volumes, I've been able to trace some parts speaking about a device of non-terrestrial origin that is capable of much more than I could ever imagine. Ancient cornariums, I will call them. Machines which are said to have been built long before mankind ever tread on this planet. The very source of the design I've used to make my own version of the machine. But I believe you wouldn't be able to create those on your own. Oh. 
a highly ornamental wooden mask that clearly depicts a cephalop cephalopod creature. Just looking at it gives me the shivers. Why? It's cute. I hope the ladder doesn't give out under my weight. You shouldn't be talking about it. Now it will definitely give. It's stuck. Um, rule of survival is close to zero, but. <sighs> Ancient conariums have the ability to transfer one's mind outside, through the endless vacuum into other receiving conariums. Just think about the possibility of shedding off the earthbound mortal coil to reach to the stars and yonder, as a free agent to see the grand scheme above and beyond the third dimension. Being able to contemplate vistas and sense things you could never ever dream of with the help of the bodily sensations. Finally, we shall overleap time, space, and dimensions, and without bodily motion, peer to the bottom of creation. Yes, I know how this sounds to you. This is incomprehensible, even for someone like me who spent almost a lifetime on such arcane topics. It is just sad to see. The knowledge has been out there all the time forevermore. And we failed to read between the lines. Or maybe we are just not ready for it yet. Hmm? What's that? Shape resembles an a uh, thing. Not yet. Dormant and standing still beneath the eternally shifting sands of Rubal Kali for who knows how many millennia. Let me go back. You've noted down the symbol. I can't. I can't open my journal. Nope.
I'm almost amazed, always amazed that in all those ancient, abandoned ruins, they always have light working. Aren't you amazed by that technology? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can we... The hallway seems like it was intentionally blocked with this ornate wall. And there are some primal writings inscribed on it. Mm hmm. Hmm. As far as I can tell, the text talks about a guardian, a formless, glistening, and reflectively iridescent black protoplasm, able to mock and reflect all forms and organs. And yet you still believe it's a guardian. To destroy the seal. Seriously, it has a label. Guard it. Don't go inside. I honestly. I always wonder why people in horrors die so frequently and so quickly. And usually, that's the reason. Supposed to be two on the bottom, one on the top. Oh, I pressed it by an accident. Like so? Mm, doesn't look right. This one's okay, I think. see it if I want to get this right. One, two, three. Approximately in line. One, two. This one is lower. Mm. Okay, great. Good job. I can do it properly. Line. There's one. There's two, like off the center a little bit. Then there's one. This one is a little bit lower. And this. This one. It looks alright, but apparently there's something is wrong because we need three working here.
found it. This mural is depicting the continents in the middle... Hmm. Jurassic era, I believe. This is marvelous. As well as overwhelming. The light from the device is obviously showing the locations of the ancient conariums. Yes, it definitely is so. For I've known two of these places from the detailed petroglyphs in the secret halls beneath the Khafre's pyramid. But they all had gone now. Even their ruins had been crumbled under the waves of human cruelty and the merciless time. But this lowermost landmass is what we call Antarctica today. It is most probable that the structure that holds the conarium is mostly enduring still today. How come you cannot understand this? Message. It was hidden. It was very well hidden. Yet you persist. Why? Why can't you just leave it alone? Better leave this place immediately. 